at Johnny Morris's Wonders of Wildlife National Museum and Aquarium. We are gonna go in, we're gonna check out the aquarium. I think there is a museum and it was ranked like one of the best museums in the nation. So we're gonna go check it out. So once we go inside, we're not gonna be doing any audio. We don't wanna be talking while people are just enjoying this natural, beautiful aquarium. But um, we'll give you some information on top of all the video footage we have. So just bear with us. Looking at you, man. Like Lana said, this particular trip in Bass Pro Shops was the kind of trip where you don't really want to disturb the silence or disturb the experience that your fellow peers are having as you walk through this facility. If you've ever been in any Bass Pro Shop, then you already know that they are behemoths in size. It's hard to imagine, but Bass Pro Shops would put any Super Walmart to shame. This particular Bass Pro Shop is the self-acclaimed granddaddy of all outdoor sports, meaning it's the largest and one of the oldest in the country. It boasts nearly 500,000 square feet of shopping fun, as well as additional space for the aquarium, motorsports museum, hunting museums, wildlife museums, and more. You can bring your boat here to get worked on, bring your knife to be sharpened, bring your rifle to be restored, practice your hunting skills in the shooting range, and of course, eat a meal in their famous restaurants. It's gonna be hard to show you how spectacular and awesome this place is, but bear with us as we walk through and show you all of our experiences. That's right, you better side, set aside a good chunk of time to see this place if you ever come because there's so much to see and do. One exhibit we didn't even expect to see was a motorsports museum inside of Bass Pro Shops. It makes sense though as Johnny Morris, the owner, has always had a huge influence in the racing world. From sponsoring NASCAR, which is probably what he's most famous for, drag racing, and many other forms of motorsports, it's no wonder he has a collection of his own. One of our favorite attractions in the motorsports museum was the presence of a couple of Dale Hart's race cars as well as the famous yet destroyed car driven by Austin Dillon in one of the Daytona 500s. As you leave the motorsports museum, you migrate over to the wildlife exhibits and hunting museums. You start off by viewing some of Johnny Morris's famous Native American artifacts. Johnny Morris has a, always had a huge fascination and connection with Native American culture and history and owns a huge collection of artifacts that you will see on display. Like I've mentioned before in a previous video, it is rumored that only a very small percentage of what he owns is on display. Once you've moved past the Native American exhibits, you will be overwhelmed with the quality and quantity of the wildlife displays. All of the displays in Bass Pro Shops Wildlife Museum bring you into the experience, into the world that animals live in. The only word I can think of to describe this area of the experience is breathtaking.
The last part of our journey lands us in the world famous Wonders of Wildlife Aquarium. It is currently, as of this video, the number one aquarium in the United States. If that makes you skeptical, believe us that when you walk into Johnny Morris's aquarium, your doubts quickly vanish. As you'll see in the sheer amount of footage we captured, this part of the journey by far took the longest and to me was the neatest. They have over 35,000 live fish, reptiles, mammals, and birds. The facility maintains over one and a half, that's right, one and a half million gallons of water, both fresh and salt. You and your loved ones can pet a stingray or watch the penguins swim and play. Maybe you want to watch divers feed sharks or play with the eels. They seem to have it all. Like I mentioned before, the Aquarium Museum not only houses different fish species, but also reptiles, mammals, and birds. This particular owl was very interested in the microphone on my camera, as it is what is called a dead cat, which is basically a wind noise blocker. Essentially, the microphone looks like prey. The owl was fun to mess with, but we quickly realized it was probably time to get out of there. gosh this was my favorite part of the wildlife exhibit perhaps one of the most underrated animals on earth a sloth they're so cute and cuddly i want one i could have stayed here all day watching it however i still probably would have never seen it move Of course, you can't forget that you're visiting Bass Pro Shops, so of course they're going to have some freshwater bass on display. Some of the bass swimming around in the exhibit was some of the largest we've ever seen. If I ever actually caught anything remotely close to the size of these lunkers, I'm certain I'd have a heart attack right there on the water. The freshwater section of the museum contains legendary reels, rods, boats, and tackle from famous anglers all around the world. They even have an Angler Hall of Fame, which honors members from several hundred years ago. Fishing has always been a staple of mankind, and the Bass Pro Museum does a great job of showing you the history behind it. The museum is also home to several albino species, which include a catfish and a very large alligator. Also, deep into the exhibit lives a black bear, which wasn't very interested in us, but was very interested in her PVC pipe. With very thick protective glass, you were able to get very close to all these animals to see what they're all about. In the end, you can color a drawing of your favorite species and hand it to the attendant for her to scan. Just like magic, your colorful creation appears on the large display. Of course, Russell just had to do it. I think it's meant for kids though.
Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We really loved the granddaddy of all outdoor stores, Bass Pro Shops in Springfield, Missouri. It was so much to unpack that I know we didn't do it justice. But hopefully, we've inspired you to go see it for yourself. We promise you won't regret it. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, as well as follow us on all the major social media platforms. See you next week. Bye!